Hey, how's it going everybody? Welcome to Freebeat and welcome to the studio. If you guys watched yesterday's video then you saw the progress of how things were coming so I thought I'd do a little update today and show you guys where we're at. We got the wallet on the snare drum, you know, to dampen the uh, overtones because I'm terrible at tuning. Speaking of the snare drum and all the drums, we've got brand new heads. We've got Evans G1s on there. It's a 14 on the snare. 12 on the tom, a 14 on the floor tom, and then believe it or not, I went to the local guitar center, they did not have an 18 inch kick in stock, so I got an 18 inch EC2 from Evans, which is like a floor tom head, but it works pretty well, sounds alright. I've got the pillow pushed so far up against it that it doesn't matter too much anyway. Another big upgrade, we've got a Shure SM57 on the, uh, on the kit now. Just one mic for now, but like I said, in the very near future, I want to get like an eight input uh, interface and do four or five tracks on the drums and then some additional inputs for other instruments. So yesterday I had the laptop right here and I've actually been working about five hours today on getting the table set up in here. I uh, moved a lot of stuff around. Then we've got my desktop computer along with a monitor. Got my keyboard and mouse and uh, yeah, running things through there. Got Ableton on there, of course, up and ready to go. So yeah, very excited the way things are coming. Today was kind of a struggle. It was raining most of the day. Uh, I wanted to take my stuff and bring it in here, but it was raining so hard I literally had to wait until about three o'clock or so to bring the computer in here. But I got everything else done, so I'm feeling pretty good about that. And now I'm to the point where I can just plug and play. Uh, can't wait to get some more mics and make stuff sound really nice in here. Also, this area right here, if I move my mouse out of the way and this stuff, if I put the camera right here and maybe get uh, like a tablecloth or something as well as some nice lighting, I can actually do some overhead shots, uh, kind of like uh, Jeremy does on Red Means Recording or Gar Hoover or really anybody that films halfway decent videos of the teenage engineering stuff and just synthesizers and that kind of stuff in general. So I am still going to be doing those kinds of videos. There is just going to be, of course, a lot more of this going on. So I figured it would be fun if I cook up a little something on the OPZ, just something really simple, and then uh, kind of like I did yesterday in yesterday's video, and then play us out in, uh, in one of those videos. Oh, always remember to turn the Wi-Fi off and everything on your phone. I was getting a horrible buzz and interference noise on the... Uh, audio box there and I was wondering, I was like, what is that? And it was my phone. So that shows how good I am at this kind of stuff. <laughs> I forget the basics. Anyway, thanks for watching this tiny little update. Um, there's going to be probably another video tomorrow. And uh, yeah, enjoy this little outro. All right, let's uh, try not to mess this up too bad. Mm -hmm. 